What up, cut ups? This is going to be a uh, collaboration mention. I'm going to be collabing for the Dozier.co. It is a high end imitation uh, perfume brand. Um, the fragrances are nice. I have worked with this company before in the past and I'm working with them again. So I was sent uh, three very nice bottles of perfume and I actually did a video. It was hmm, last month. I did a video and I displayed all three perfumes, but this month I'm going to display just one, feature one, and it's the one that I have on now. It is the Woody number one. So I actually have this fragrance on right now. I don't know about you ladies, but after I put my perfume on, I like to go and just spray my hair with it just a little bit, you know, just a little bit. So when you walk in the room and toss your hair back, everybody can smell that fragrance, just hit them like that. So yeah, but anyway, ladies, um, check it out the name of this perfume company is dozier dot dot co okay dot co if you want to order something um just check it out see if you like it the fragrances are really light and very soft and feminine so check it out ladies i definitely do have my little collection and hopefully I can collect them all. So the discount code if you order is Adrian Slays 10. All right, everybody, stay tuned in. Hello, everybody. I am at the nail salon right now. I'm getting my nails done for the funeral that is going to be Friday. The theme is blue. So, match my nails up with my dress and with my awful Macy suit. Um, yeah guys, I'm, I'm being strong so far, but I know it's going to be a very, very sad funeral. So I'm just trying to prepare and take care of all of the small things like right now so I don't have to be running around and doing extra stuff let me get it over with Whew. but anyway guys stay tuned in for the rest of this video I'm gonna see if I can get my mother to, to cook me some salmon and some veggies and that parchment paper so stay tuned in I see eggs, scrambled eggs, hash brown sausage and pancake. Okay, that's what you want. I got scrambled eggs and yes. beef beef sausage. Beef sausage. Okay, I'm gonna warm this up. And it's I'll really warm, Ray. I mean, girl, Ray, right that's the wrong my <laughs> mat. Cause they hurt my sister again. I swear to God, I'm gonna have to take notice. Yeah. Uh -uh. I'm gonna protect my little sister. That's my job. I understand. Nobody's so, uh, gonna hurt her. Hey, now that I know how all of the, the drama went down. And Jessica lied and mm -hmm. all this and that. Yeah, she did. It was some family drama going on where uh, my auntie Raynette and her kids, grandkids, all got into a my fight. Hand for a fist fight. So <laughs> we can talk and eat and do all this at the same time. Because I'm hungry. Mm. Let's put some salt. Where is salt and pepper? Right over there. Okay. Look over there. Yeah, so anyway, there was a lot of drama that went down, y'all. A lot of drama. They that hurt went my down. sister. Yeah, right. That got a couple of knots on her head, she said. <laughs> <sighs> really? Y'all like, no, my mama's crazy. She got problems, y'all. <laughs> but they fuck But she right, though. No, mama, you cool. I, no, you cool. They you cool. messed with my sister, yeah, baby. Yeah. 
I know how to handle them. So many stories on how what was going, what happened, and what went. All down. I know is this. We okay. They did it to my sister. I didn't run over there. And, and I went over there and tried to. I did what Jesus would do. That time. But anybody put their hands on her, I'm going to have to lay hands. And that's all, too. That's all I got to say about it. Or lay something. <laughs> Might not be him. Well. I think they get the picture. <laughs> well, anyway. They gonna hurt my sister, though. Please. Now. Nah. Everybody know. Yeah, because see, man, I was just, man was just telling me how it went down. Everybody know me. He was just telling me how it went down, though. Man was just telling me, so. Leave my sister alone, yo. Because my, my great niece is there. And Which, my great niece ran up to me and just held me like she ne haven't seen me in years and years. You know, and Cassidy. She just lost her dad. That's my cousin Shine, y'all. And I really do want peace. His baby mama. My cousin that just passed, his but baby they mama. jumped on my sister. Got into it with. Right now, okay. Now. I want peace. I said, let the two girls solve this. The two teen. It started out as a teenage fight. Let them take care of this. That's good. The two teenagers. They love each other. They best friends. They love Stop. each other. They can take care of this. Um. Uh, let the grown-ups stay out of it. See, don't, don't it just smooth out? Everything be all right. But please, Mommy. don't put your hands on my sister again. And I'm so good. We heard about that night, but it was a lot of factors out there where yeah, I we know. know we didn't we we know us too. We got to know what the whole situation. We ain't just gonna go run up in nobody's drama. Bro, I'm gonna do some damage. And so why go run up in it? And it started out as a teenage thing, and then it ended up as a grown people fight, and where black gloves and pistols and all that type of stuff got involved. <laughs> and I'm just saying. But they don't know how to use them. I'm just saying though. We don't react like that. We got to know the whole situation, how it went down, because we know how our, our family is, too. Now, that's to be in, in all honesty. So, hey. Yeah, hey. But, yeah, it's going to be some real problems, though, you know, if, if um, this situation get out of hand. You know, from it's what so I heard, because there's so many stories. People were saying that it was Sukalu and Nana fighting in Raynette House. That this time Nana got the best of Sukalu, which is why Bop Bop jumped in. And when Bop Bop jumped in, Raynette was trying to get Bop Bop. But now so much day. Raynette said Bop Bop uppercuffed her and was going in on her. So Raynette was trying to get Bop Bop off of Sukalu. That's when the big sister came in and thought Raynette was fighting her. See? I didn't know. I, I didn't know but, that. But wait, I heard this went on outside. I just no, no, I was just in my car before I got over here. It started in right that house. But mm -hmm. Raynette told me it happened outside. See, yeah. hey, I talked to Jessica. It says Jessica is the story. mother. Jessica said the fight started in the house. The little girl that was in the fight, Nana, nah, nah, she was just in my car telling me it started in the house. Mm -hmm. Yeah, see, there's so many stories out there. You can't just go right and react them mm -mm. off something. And then you in trouble because you know. You know. Mm -mm. Mm. Well, I need to know the truth. Yeah, me too. I want my know. sister told me it was outside. The fight was outside. It was started inside, though. But it, it broke out and got outside. Mm-hmm. Yep. We was going through enough that day. 
with Macy. And that's where my focus has been. Right. And I just left the uh, cemetery this morning. We got through with everything that we need to do at the cemetery. This hard on me. Everybody. Not like it is for me, though. I'm his sister. I'm his oldest sister. We buried Michael last year. And now Macy this year. This is tripped out. These are my younger siblings. I have raised them. You know how hard it is for me to see them falling like this? I cannot imagine. Well, I only got one. Well, on your side, it's by you only got one brother. I've seen my sister Shirley go. All them younger than I am. I thought they'd be burying me. But God, I know it's God's way. Yep. And that's the way we have to deal with it. But I did text Jessica all the information that I knew of because, like the no, I, I see, said. I would love for them to be there because they love Macy and Macy exactly, loves them. Exactly. And that's why I'm saying. they are family. They are. They are. I mean, they they. She said, I've been around y'all since I was one years old. Y'all, I consider y'all my family. That's the little girl that, that was in the fight. No, no. But she got... I'm going over there and talk to them, too. But see, Renette's sneaky. Renette would go over there and reverse things in her New York second. But I'm going over there to talk to Jessica again. Jessica lie a lot too, though. Mom. I know, but I won't lie them at that funeral. I wish that they could be there, but lay you know, everything no down out of respect for Macy. I wish they could do it, but I honestly don't think it's gonna happen. And then, man, I was just talking to man, and man said, "You know, there's too many people say she come, they slapping her. So Jessica show up, they slapping her. So, hey." They ain't gonna do shit. They might. They not. Who, who, they what might. people? Pebbles and Lean. I don't know who ever said it. He didn't no. tell me who. He just said that's what people said. If the girl show up, she asking for it. Jessica ain't no point. She sure ain't. I ain't worried about her. But she pregnant though. She shouldn't even be out there fighting nobody. And if they find she her, they go going to pregnant. jail. She they find her. Pregnant. All she got to do is dial 911. They is going to jail. So leave her alone. Let her come pay her respect because she got that right. Yeah. I think she do too. But at the end of the day, I got to stand with my family though. If I go down to, now that I see or now that I hear, but let, heard, it, let, let them do all that after Macy has been paid his respect. I don't think they're going to do it though, mama. I hate to say it, but yeah. it may not I work that way. I hope they do. Mm-mm. Not this time. Right, let go over there and talk to Jessica and stuff. Uh, Adra. Nico told me she was Call, talking to her the other day. Call a truce until uh, after this is over. That's the respectable thing to do. And I'm not going to uh, have nothing else less than that at my brother's funeral. Right. I don't care who I have to mess Good up. Luck, you just gotta be prepared. You know, it's gonna be one of them. You don't unexpected funerals. You don't, just don't know what's no, gonna happen. No, it's not gonna be none of that shit at my brother's funeral. None of it. I hope not, but it won't. I'm not worried about it. They might well sit their dumb asses down. Excuse <laughs> my friend. <laughs> but y'all gonna see Queen D in action. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Girl, they're still talking about you and that uh, bag of rum. I'm talking about, take me back. Took me back. <laughs> the people still hollering about that video, girl. <laughs> they know your mama is a trip. So you know I'm a man <laughs> from a long way back. I know some tricks. <laughs> mm. You know? <laughs> that was funny. So though. they better sit down and respect my brother, you know. Right. I ain't no telling what I like to have to 
do. Um, call of truth. To? I say this call of truth. It's about paying our last Y'all respect after. to Uncle Macy. That's what it's and about. Bear it. When you, if y'all want to go be ignorant and ghetto, do it after my brother is gone. When we bury him in there, do it then. Go ahead, do it. Do it. And y'all hit my sister, I'm going to be there though. Right. That's a whole different scenario mm -hmm. after my brother has paid his due. But you won't do it at his funeral or his repast. You won't do it. Right. You're going to be in big trouble if you try. Hear me go. No. I just gave some. You're begging too much. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Here. Uh uh. Come on. Mm mm. He tried to be tough because he got a new Chicago Bears collar. Oh. It's crazy. Mom, oh. you think I should get him a blue trench coat or the regular tan one? Blue. I knew she was going to say blue. I'm going to say blue. That, that's my favorite color. Look, the man put the little blue butterfly on my nails and the red. Let me see, Mom. Put a blue butterfly. Oh, my. Please. Let me, you got to see my wig, Mom. I need your approval and you know it. I'm look, nails, the blue is the blue is the funeral color, so I just started early. I'm not wearing blue. I'm wearing blue. I'm blue wearing and white. Basically the and same black. thing I wore to Michael's funeral. Blue and white and black. I'm wearing. Okay. Yeah. My um. My dress matches suit. You saw my new barrette booties, didn't you? Mm -mm. That's what I gotta go get. I gotta, but I guess that's gonna happen another time. Cause I'm gonna show y'all. Man, wait. man gotta go to court. My cousin, man gotta go to court. Wait, wait, wait. Watch him. So <laughs> he gotta, gotta go to court today, and he might be sentenced and might have to do some time. And me and man is like this. Me and man like this. Okay. That's my, me and man should have been brother and sister. But um, it's like really losing him too. So I, I hope they postpone it today. But he's supposed to be sentenced today. I hope they postpone it, but I am going to be there though. I'm definitely going to be there. Oh yeah, them shy, mama. Oh yeah, them shy. Wait, 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 get it right there so they can see everything. There, right there. Whoa. Oh, these are sharp. These are sharp. <laughs> Look at that, I'm going like a rock star. <laughs> They're nice. I do not I play. Go my some. brother, he dressed his by hand over. Yeah. Him he and did. I, we got the same style. Got blue in there, too. I see that. We got blue. That's cute. They, they call them yeah. red. And you know who made them? Uh -uh. Betsy Johnson. Uh -huh. I love me some Betsy Johnson. Oh, that's the lady you got um, the purses. They got the purses, right? And she got everything else. I know Nick would be uh, having her purses. I got her purses, too. I know. Where's this box? What about I didn't bring the box. I got them out the box so they'd be ready for me Friday. But I want you to approve this. It's a lace front. Oh. Well. It's, it's very glamorous. But. Well. You gotta. The lace gotta be. Who gonna put this on for you? Ne um, Kaya. You sh oh, okay. Alright. Well, Kaya. Or oh, should I go to w somewhere else? I don't know, mama. Why? Wow. I, I, I mean. I think it's curly and pretty. Just got to be calm. That was look. Put some um, oil on it. I got to go buy me some oil for my hair. Well, too. I'm going to have all that. To, you know I'm going to get It's got the middle part or it can have a side part. As long as the lace is cut back far enough. It will be. I'm where you're able to sure. just put it on like this one. See, you don't see no lace nowhere. Oh, you just put it on. Okay. But, yes, yeah, it's just going to be all right. It's going to sit down, lay down right. Yeah. And everything. You're not going to see the light, this part of it. Right. You know? It's going to be right. Yeah. But I wanted to be glamorous. 
Yeah, I think it looks nice though. I'm gonna put the makeup on. I can do my own makeup very well. Mm, and I'm gonna have my niece I get my mine pre plucked. Oh. And I hate eyelashes. Let's see. You'll be able to see that part. But I guarantee by Friday evening they'd be gone. Probably the same. Yeah, but, same day. Yeah. <laughs> well, y'all. I'm gonna have her put them on <coughs> Thursday evening when she does my wig. Who gonna That's do it, Kaya? Say my game. Kaya. Who gonna yeah, do it? Yeah, Kaya. My niece Kaya gonna do it. Oh, I, I thought about there's a shop right down the street on Burleigh. I thought about going in there to see if I can get someone to. So where is the up. where is the funeral gonna be? It's not gonna be on 47th and Burleigh. It's gonna be on six. If it's the 60th. They, that was just a funeral home he in now. He got both of them. He just bought this one on Capitol. It's a lot bigger. Okay. And they talking about having a repast there. I don't think so. In a funeral home? Yeah. Because what if somebody go in the wrong door? Mm. Pop goes the weasel and the bodies go pop. <laughs> <laughs> Take the wrong turn up in there. No, Ooh. me and my brother Michael did that before. Uh uh. Michael said, Come on, look in here. We couldn't. Why was y'all even in the hospital doing that? We were in the funeral home. Oh. Golden Gate oh, funeral Lord. home. Who funeral was it? Timmy's? No. Oh. It was somebody's funeral. I can't remember who funeral. But we were looking for the funeral director. And we couldn't find anybody there. So we, we went uh -oh. to the office, no, nobody. Mm -mm. So we start knocking on the door. Mm -mm. And Michael opened the door, girl, none but bodies. Mm -mm. And caskets ready to be, you know, fixed mm -mm. up and stuff. And then the man said, oh, I said, Oh, he was back there with the bodies. And he was Yikes. trying to fix them up. Mm. And well, somebody got to do it, though. I said, I said, man, somebody got to do we're it. looking for something. He said, oh, no, they, 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 y'all can't come in here. I said, hell, it's too late. We already seen too much. That's too much. Child, I mean, the whole room was full of, of dead folks. Mm -mm, that's scary. Like, we won't have a repash in the field. Uh -uh. Who idea was that? That's bizarre. That's too bizarre. For I me. know Halloween comes, but I'm not in the Halloween that too. Right. <laughs> With that being said, y'all. <laughs> See y'all. <laughs> See you. Nice seeing you guys. Bye, y'all. Love you. They're going to be talking about you till the next time. Oh. That okay, everybody. I am finally done with my day today guys um yeah uh i had to go to court for uh my cousin man he he was being sentenced today and we got really blessed because we thought he was facing like five years in five years on paper and the judge was so cool he had to do that thank god thank god so all he got really was just 12 months and that's just in the house correction no prison time Okay, um, yeah, it just brought back a whole bunch of memories and stuff, being in the courthouse and seeing the jail and, oh, y'all, oh, Lord, those judges, just the hallways, everything was just, I'm so glad that I'm out of that, um, completely out of that, okay? So, yeah, I'm about to just finish getting my eyebrows done. I guess she did all right, y'all. I guess she did all right. My little magnetic lashes coming off today. They ain't stay on there, y'all. They ain't stay on. But my hair is so stringy because I put some Isoplus oil sheet in it. And um, I was told not to use that, so I had to go buy some other stuff and um, put it in on top of it. So I got to just go take this thing off and rewash it. But overall, today has been a good day. I still have to go you know what? I need to go right over here to shoe trend because I do need some shoes. That's the only thing I got to do. I just got to get some shoes and that's it. But honestly, I think I'll wait till tomorrow because it's, it's already going to be getting dark. 
So I'm just going to probably take my tail home. And it's going to be a wrap for today. Okay. Hope y'all enjoyed the video.